First, I love to give praise and glory to God Almighty. For without his son, Jesus Christ's sacrifice, we would not be able to come to you with the power of the Holy Ghost. Now sit back and relax and open your heart and mind from a word from the Lord from our precious little home located at St. Paul's Church, 7 Raymond Street in Norwalk, Connecticut. To the Antichrist. And the book of Revelation said the Antichrist is going to call fire from heaven and they're going to get fire from heaven. But don't you believe in it because Jesus, the word of the living God, has been sealed in me. And he said if an angel comes from heaven and show you any other thing, don't believe it. But you got to wait on the Lord. Wait on Jesus. Say it. Say it. I heard Job say, all my poor days, I'm going to wait on the Lord. Yeah, God, he said, the Lord give it and the Lord take it. We're going to 
we'll get to it after a while. Praise the Lord. But let's look at it again. Praise God. Uh, yes. Act regularly. Uh, in order uh, to encourage and strengthen one another. To hold fast to Christ. Uh, as the end approaches. Every day. Praise God. Stop that. Now there's another thing. Stop fighting one another. Uh, we're going to get to that too. Because... Fighting is the root. Well, I, 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 I'm going to get to it now. Praise God. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, so, so, but let me say there's a little piece on it. Praise God. When we are in reproach against one another, the Bible says God cannot hear my prayer. So if I'm fighting with you and just going to not really recognize Christ as our Savior, not encourage one of you, praise God, and encourage one another, and come and pray. I, I'm just saying a, 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 a word that never got off the floor. That's right. Never, never got up to nowhere. Now you got to remember one thing: Jesus told us to love ye one another. And then he said, by this love, all men shall know that you are my disciple. And then, praise God, love does not harm his brother or sister. Love does not derail the service of God, nor the word of God, nor the ways of God. Bless the Lord. No, love carries and love goes through. Love endure, love stand, love delivers and love bears. Look at somebody say, do you really know how to live? That's another, that's another subject. That's another topic. We'll come back to it. We'll come back to that too. Oh, bless the Lord. Praise God. We withdraw from the body of Christ and neglect uh, meetings with other uh, believers. Uh, we become weak, uh, not strong, and more uh, so, uh, uh, sus suspectful unto the enemy. In other words, the enemy gets the authority over us. Because I'm weak now, I'm not praying. I'm weak now, I'm not really getting together with the saints. Because I ran in here five or ten minutes trying to catch the prayer. See, if I ride in here five or ten minutes and trying to catch the prayer, I ain't making one hour of the whole week. Come on here. Come on here. Come on here. Oh, Lord. Y'all want me to do like so. Y'all want me to do like so. Bless him. But no, no, no. I need to an hour with the Lord. But I don't need to mess with it because I know what I need. I, yeah. Pray God if I'm weak and want to be strong, I got to make my way. And no sense in me walking around crying about what's happening. Because it's not going to change. Right. But I know if I get to the altar, oh, something the Lord's going to do. Something going to change. Pray to our God. You got to really know. So the devil wants me to walk around. He wants me to walk around and drive back and forth and up and down. And pray I'll never have time for church and never have time to pray. Because he know and nothing is never going to change. But if you really want to change, you got to put God first to the change in your life. Praise the Lord. It may not be today, but God begin to work in your background. Because there's some things in your background God got to do before he bring you up. God got to work it in your background. Tell it all thank you. Bless him. Oh, bless him. Praise God. So, praise God as we move on. As we move on. Praise God. Now, now, don't be weak because you have not come regularly to pray. And then that introduces and increases your faith. Don't let the devil use you and use you as a pawn. In other words, Satan laughs at us, pray God, because he see how weak we are. Pray God, we say we're strong. We're saying we're St. Paul, Church of God in Christ. Living now to live again. The devil says, oh, but he's falling out laughing. Praise the Lord because he know out of all of that you ain't prayed nothing. All right. You ain't even prayed 10 minutes. Come on. Praise God. How you gonna get the glory on 10 minutes? Praise God. Oh, somebody help me. Oh, bless the Lord. Pray! Jesus equated with.
with faith. Praise God. Let's move on. Praise God. What can lead a person to apostasy? What, what, what can lead a person to turn from God and turn from church? you got to realize what the church is. The church don't belong to the preacher. That's right. Let me say it again. The church don't belong to the preacher. If I turn from the church, and Jesus said, upon this rock, I'll build my church. That's what Jesus said. The church belonged to Jesus. All right. So when you lay up and lay around and said somebody asked you to come to church, praise Lord, you tell them, I, I, I ain't going today. I, I ain't going to church. That's that's I'm just tired. And you you telling the Lord you you're not going to His church. You are talking directly to Jesus because there's not one of us in here owns the church. All right. All right. All right. When are you going to fix it? After a while, when? All right. If you're going to pray to him and build that relationship and nothing getting fixed, the devil is shouting and having a field day over you. Don't let him shout and have a field day over you. Pray to God, I got, I, got to, I got to get there because I got, I got a little problem. And I'm going to tell God all about my problem. And I know when I tell him about my problem, he's going to help me do something about it. Tell the Lord, because get a man extremity is God opportunity. Man can't see what God sees all things. Man can't reach what God reaches all the way. Man don't know what God knows all things. He can move where I can't move.
John was put in prison. John was put in prison. Jesus came into Galilee. Jesus came to Galilee. Preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God. Preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God. Now you gotta remember, this is the man that baptized Jesus. This is the man that baptized him in the river of Jordan. But John even wanted to know. Go ahead. And saying, What did he say? A time is fulfilled. The time is fulfilled. And the kingdom of God is at hand. And the kingdom of God is at hand. Right. Repent ye. You gotta repent. And believe the gospel. And have faith in the word of God. In other words, repent. Change your mind. Change your heart. Change your will. Praise God. Don't die just being you. Thank you God. I don't want to die being just flesh. Thank you God. But I want to die being when my flesh is under subjection and God is in control. Praise God. Praise our God. Oh, bless the Lord. Why? Because, praise God, the kingdom of God is at hand. It's already here. It's already here. And then we find it again, praise God, Luke picked it up and said the kingdom of God lies with man. Praise God, and in man. Oh, bless the Lord. Well, again, praise God, Luke 8, and 8, 4 through 6 says what to us? And when much people were gathered together. And when much people were gathered together. And were come to him out of every city. And came to him out of every city. He spake by a parable. Jesus began to tell a parable because that's the only way that they could understand. They couldn't understand anything else because they were men, uh, farmers, and they were not really educated, so they spoke by a parable. What did he say? A sower went out to sow He said a sower went out to sow some seeds. And as he sowed, as he sowed, some fell by the wayside. Some fell by the wayside. And it was trodden down. And, and the seed was trodden down. Yes. And the fowls of the air devoured them. And the fowls of the air ate them. All right. And some fell upon a rock. And some of the seeds fell upon the rock. And as soon as it was sprung up, uh -huh. it withered away. They, they came up, but they withered away because it, it, it fell upon a rock. All right. Because it lacked moisture. Because it lacked moisture and had no root to it. Mm. All right, go ahead. That's the end of the sentence. Go ahead to twelve. Those by the way, those by the wayside. Now he begins to tell them and explain to them by the wayside. Those that's by the wayside. Talking about the soil that sows seed. Go ahead. In other words, he's representing you and me. What are we doing? We're sowing seed. And we got to be careful how we sow our stuff because some of that stuff is laying by the wayside. Now some of that stuff you're doing just ain't no good. Some of that stuff can't catch root for nothing. Then uh, some of, some, sometimes we sow stuff on, 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 on stony ground. And it, it, it comes up, but it don't last long. Go ahead. Those by the wayside are they that hear. Yeah. They come at the devil. They that hear, they come to the devil. And take it away the word out of their heart. By the time, time to get out the door, they take, take, take the word out of your heart. Lest they should believe and be saved. And lest they believe and be saved. They on the rock are they. Now they that are on the rock are they. Which when they hear. Uh -huh. Receive the word but with joy. They receive the words, you know, the folks that those believers that's on the rock really receive the word and they rejoice. Yes. And these have no roots. But they don't have no roots. They don't have no, they don't have, they don't have no, 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 nothing, no, no, nothing, nothing under there to give them the nourishment to continue. In other words, you let, we, we, if you're not careful, we let the devil speak to our head. The Lord told you what to do, but you won't do it anyway. The way you want to do it. The Lord has spoken to your heart. But you really don't want to change the thing you do. You're nothing but a seed that's coming up on a rock without roots. Go ahead. Which for a while believe. Which for a while believe. And in time of temptation fall away. But in the time of temptation, these types of folks fall away. Apostasy is falling away. 
Apostasy is giving over and letting the devil have his way. Praise our God. Oh, blessed, 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 blessed. Go ahead. And that which fell among thorns are they. Uh, the ones that fell among the thorns are they. Which, when they have heard. Which, uh huh. Go forth and are choked with care. When, when, when they go forth and they pray to the people get around them, and you you got to be careful how you listen to other folks. They ain't going to do nothing but choke you out of the word of the Lord. They're going to choke it right down and they're going to change your mind and you fall into unbelief. Choke. What happened to you, brother? What happened to your sister? I just got choked today. <coughs> I spiritually got choked today. Praise God. Why? Because I, I listened to other stuff that really was not sound doctrine. Tell the Lord, thank you. Oh, bless the Lord. Go ahead. And pleasures of this life. Uh -huh, and pleasures of this life. And bring no fruit to perfection. And bring no fruit to perfection. But that on the good ground uh -huh. they, mm -hmm. which in an honest and good heart, yes. having heard the word, having heard the word, keep it, keep it. Have heard the word, what word? Come on, come on, let's get let, 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 we, we, what we're gonna do. We, we're gonna pray every day. Pray the Lord, and we're gonna be here for the word, and we're gonna have a Bible study, and we're gonna have a walk PWW. Pray the Lord, we're gonna have our Sunday school, and what we want you to do is get in it so you can learn the more of the Lord. Pray the Lord, and, and, and so then you, the reason why you're being told this so you can add this to your agenda. And when you add it to your agenda, you can kind of participate in the necessary thing that's needed for your soul. This is soul stuff here. Soul saving, soul searching. Your soul got to go before God. Now, did not he say on that sign out there that, pray the Lord, that the spirit is sharper than a two headed sword? Dividing what? Son? Pray the Lord, right on down to the marriage, bone, and all that stuff. Well, the soul and the spirit are it is very uh, uh, together, but the word of God and the spirit of God can divide it. And that's why we say that we are made up of three components. But when I die, just the first component going to leave here is the flesh. The flesh is going back to the ground. The soul and spirit still got to go and meet God. Now, if then I die again, see, people don't know that we live one time, but we can die twice. Oh, yes, yeah, 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 yeah. I can die twice. I can die in the flesh. That's one time. But when I stand soul and spirit before God, he can condemn me and I die twice. Once I'm dead before the presence of God, the Bible said, he wipes me away from his mind and remember me no more. Then the scripture said, I'll be forever. Somebody say forever. Forever. You know what forever means. I read that, brother, I dropped to my knees. I said, no, no, Lord, I don't want to ever be in a forever. I don't want to be ever, forever condemned. Forever, forever tormented. Forever, forever, forever. As long as God shall live is forever. Now don't you know I don't want to, no, 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 no. Something got to give. You got to, you got to, you know, I don't understand folks. I don't understand, I don't understand what's in our head. I don't understand what's in our mind. I don't understand the liquor shots that go through the brain. I don't understand the message that's being captured. Maybe we don't know what forever is. Forever is forever, is forever, forever. Yeah. I don't want to wind up like that. You don't want to wind up like that. Praise God. So the only person that's going to hell should be the devil. You should tell him to go head on. But I'm going this way. Go ahead, go ahead, my sister. Having heard the word, keep it. I know y'all ready because it's always time to go. I know it's time to go. You see how quiet it gets when time to go? Oh, That's because y'all trained for that 1.30. Yeah. Oh, now, well, I got to finish this today because I'm not coming back to the party. All right. All right. Y'all trained for 1.30. All right. Bless the Lord, that 1.30 got you. Yeah. You know, I, in the prayer hour, I can tell when it's about 7 o'clock. Mm. I can be summoning the full praying now and I don't hear nothing, nothing back of me. Nothing. <laughs> I look up and say, yeah, it's about seven o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Having heard the word, keep it. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Oh, bless God. Having heard the word, keep it. Having 
God. Now go get, get John 5 right quick. We're going to make it quick and then we're going to get that. I have come in my Father's name. Now listen to what Jesus said. I have I am come in my Father's name. And ye receive me not. And you don't even receive me. Yes. If another shall come in his own name. If another shall come in his own name. That's what people do. That's what, that's what we do. Yes. Him ye will receive. Him we will receive. We will hear. In other words, I can come in the name of the Lord and tell you the truth. And somebody else can tell you something wrong, but you won't believe that. You don't believe me. But you're going to believe the wrong. That's already a prophecy that's being fulfilled. Yes. Right. All the wrong stuff we hear right. and we believe. Right. But when we are told the truth about a thing, we don't believe. Right. Go ahead. How can ye believe uh -huh. which receive honor one of another uh -huh. and seek not the honor that cometh from God only? Oh my God. Go ahead. For had ye believed Moses, uh -huh. ye would have believed me. If you believe Moses, you would have believed me. For he wrote of me. Because Moses wrote of me. But if ye believe not his writing. But if you don't believe Moses' writing. How shall ye believe my word? Then how can you believe the words that I speak? Praise our God. That's what Jesus is saying. Praise the Lord. Praise God. Oh, bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Now, now, now we're going to believe. Let's believe. Let's believe wholeheartedly. Wholeheartedly believe God. In other words, you can't dump the Old Testament and just gonna take the new. Right. Or you can't take the new and forget about the old. You need the old and the new. For if you believe Moses, then you will hear me. Because Moses wrote of me. Tell it all, thank you. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, my sister, 46. Thank you, God. 47. That was the end of 47. Okay, good. Bye, praise God, praise God. By, by the hardness. Uh, 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 becomes tolerant of sin. You see what happened is the reason why now, 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 the reason why people go on in the wrong era is because uh, the hardness of their heart. Now you're not going to get it wrong and stay wrong continually. All right. But now I want you, want you to understand when you see folks that don't be encouraged by other people wrong. When you see folks in wrong conditions and been there 20 years in, 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 in Rome, we've been there 10, 20 years, or whatever it is. They ain't never gonna straighten up. That's because their spirit now is tolerant with the sin that they're doing. It's nothing to it. It's no guilt found in it. There's nothing speaking to them. There is nothing. And when it gets like that, it is dangerous. The devil writes you on his book of death. He don't have a book of life, he have a book of death. He writes you on his book. Because he knows that you come, you, when your arrival comes, you, you come. Because in your spirit, you don't know and, and don't really understand, it's time to fold up the wrong and get with the right. Now, when you, when, when, when you uh, 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 cheat him and turn to God, he gets upset. And he comes after you. Tell the Lord, thank you. Oh, praise God. And we're tolerant to sin in uh, uh, their own life. Thank you, God. Praise God. And, and the Holy Spirit of uh, fire is put out gradually. If you've got the Holy Ghost, you will put it fire out. Mm. The Holy Ghost is not going to remain in you. Yes. Praise God. All those years that God has grace that he gives us. Yeah. If you are in a wrong era, the grace of God will help you get right. But if you stay in the wrong era, the Holy Ghost is going to vacate property. The fire will go out and he's going to leave. Lord have mercy. Praise our God. Oh, bless the Lord. And Lord, with the Lord is with you. Praise God. Hold on to him. That's right. Yeah, pray God, what am I saying here? The Lord never told me in the flesh that I can't get them. But if it told me, but this is what he told me, when you find myself in a condition, well, get it right. Yeah. You don't wait till tomorrow. Son, you wait now. Get it right. Get it right. Tell the Lord, thank you. Ah, bless the Lord. Oh, but let's look again. Let's look again. 
We put the fire out of the Holy Ghost. Well, what do you say? Well, 1 Thessalonians 5 and 19 says what? Quench not the spirit. There it is. There it is. Don't put the fire out. Don't put it out. Quench not the spirit. Praise God. Uh, 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 uh. Reject not the loss of manifestation. And he will soon leave the Holy Ghost. And in my conclusion, for the Lord, if backsliding continues on right. its course, All right. and if it don't be unchecked, individuals may be, praise God, if it, if it didn't reach to the point of when there is no second beginning. For the Lord, there's no second return. Because the grace of God, I've learned, praise the Lord, when I take the grace of God and trample over the grace of God. When I will know the power of God by rejecting the Holy Ghost, I'm telling Lucifer's kingdom that the Holy Ghost can't keep me. I'm telling the world that the power of God is not with me. For the Lord, the Bible said, if I'm going to travel over the Holy Spirit who is sensitive uh, unto God, I want you to know there is no second round in it. Pray the Lord, there is no comeback of when you want to come back. Because when God turned his back on you, uh, pray the Lord, I learned from the books that his, he don't even hear my cry. He won't even hear my prayer. So everybody, there's some people that are on the sick bed and when they don't even believe the Lord at all and have done everything and turned their back on God. When I get on my sick bed, there's no need to say, Lord, have mercy on me because he's not going to hear my cry. He's not going to deliver me anymore. Tell the Lord, thank you. But while the blood yet one moment in my veins Step forward unto God and do all the glory that I can. Tell the Lord, thank you. I must emphasize that while, pray the Lord, backsliding is a danger of all who uh, drift away from the faith and cause apostasy. Pray the Lord does not, I pray God does not occur without a consistent willfulness sinning against the voice and the spirit of God. I want you to know it's not a one or two day, it's not a one year or two year thing. But the devil will let you go five, ten, fifteen years steady backing up from God. But I want you to know the Lord that I have done this through the Holy Ghost. He'll let you know every day. Every day he'll let you know. Come back, my brother. Come back, my sister. I need you. I want to hear your prayer. I need you. And you need me. Tell the Lord, thank you. The Lord hands open unto the backslider. All the day long, he's calling with his word. All the day long, he said, come, Lord. Thank you. 
say, I just want to be saved. Bless the Lord. Uh, we want to say that uh, we, we, uh, at 3 o'clock, 